I'm Dennis Thorin. I'm the Vice President of Engineering and Technology at Ingersoll Rand. We're here at uh, Lafayette, uh, Indiana at Purdue University. Why is Ingersoll Rand sponsoring this solar decathlon effort by Purdue University? Well, uh, Ingersoll Rand is sponsoring this, uh, the Purdue Solar Decathlon because uh, this competition is about a net zero energy home. Going to net zero energy involves green and sustainable technologies and this is one of our corporate foundational objectives and goals, I would say. It's a corporate ideal that we want to espouse as a company. And sponsoring this project allows us to show the community that we're serious about this and at the same time learn new innovative things that we could possibly incorporate in our product portfolio. Pretty exciting. We talk Absolutely. about safety, comfort, and efficiency. Right. So we've got all the businesses here, club car, Solar powered club car, we're sitting Industrial in it here. Technologies. Industrial technologies, our train branded, train brand, uh, Schleg branded products. Schleg Link, we've got all the really cool yep. stuff here coming together in a home that's uh, hopefully what we'll see out in the future to drive you know better um, sustainability. Yeah. Pretty cool. How do you like working with the student team here at Purdue? Uh, well, I really enjoy working with the student team here. Um, it gives me a great opportunity to see something that has been planned for two years come together. Um, I'm proud to be uh, an employee of Ingersoll Rand, seeing how our products can uh, complement the mission they have here to make a net zero energy home. Um, you know, it's a great recruiting opportunity for us, seeing some talented individuals uh, come together to do a great thing, and I I'm, it's a joy to be part of the project. That's awesome, and, and for me, you know, uh, University recruiting, university relations are really important, and uh, Purdue is an important school for us. So I'm sure all the students here like to hear that. That is an um, important thing for us. Dennis, how would this competition and this event that we're doing today, how does this uh, support Ingersoll Rand's mission to sustainability? Well, I, you know, I think this is a great opportunity for us to um, really practice open innovation, looking for new ideas. So this is longer term innovation is the way I think about it. We're looking for ideas how we can save energy, um, drive more efficient homes, make sure that we're providing systems uh, for a home, getting after safety, comfort, and efficiency. You know, I've got a wide open mind to the types of uh, creativity that's coming out of this team and this effort here. So uh, we'll, we'll bring it in uh, with an open mind. There may be some ideas we haven't thought about right. uh, that will help us with driving energy efficiency and sustainability, and that's an important mission for our company. We've got our, our organization, Center for, Center for Energy Efficiency and Sustainability, and uh, we're all aligned looking for opportunities to drive products that have a, uh, an impact on the environment in a positive way with that green um, initiative and thumbprint on the environment. And that's what this is going to help us understand. Great. We're here today with a group um, participating with the students, helping to build the house. Um, I've learned an awful lot about the program and what's in front of us, but can you just describe some of what the next steps are between now and the time uh, that the home shows up on the, the mall in Washington, sure. D.C.? We're going to be doing a test run of building the home, commissioning the home through June. We'll be putting our products in and making sure all of our systems work and uh, everything is smooth with the house. And then we'll be breaking it up into modules and it'll be shipped uh, over the latter part of the summer to Washington, D.C. Then we'll be setting it up on the mall, the National Mall, just south of Lincoln Memorial is where the site is. Um, setting it up over a couple week period and uh, with uh, open competition to the public starting uh, the very last part of September.